Well, as police searched, schools went into lockdown and police told people to lock their doors. The night team's Theo Keith continues our team coverage from where the search started earlier today in Fitchburg. Theo. Yeah, Eric, the search started right here on Nesbitt Road. This manhunt certainly inconvenienced and concerned a lot of people near here. Businesses locked down and parents say their kids had to hide and sit in the dark at school. A scene straight out of a movie came to Fitchburg this afternoon as the SWAT team searched a house. Businesses along Nesbitt Road locked down. And all of a sudden, you know, we saw the cop cars and we're like, what's going on? And all the chaos came about five, ten minutes later where they started blocking the roads. The SWAT team came out, guns were drawn, they had the police dog coming out, sniffing the house, and they sat like that for about 15 minutes or so, and that was the end of it. Roads closed as the search moved west along Maple Grove Road. Police contacted thousands of homeowners and businesses in the area and told them to lock their doors. So we went around and told all the teachers immediately, and I went to go find our security to let them know as well and he was already aware um, he was talking to our pastor to figure out what precautions exactly they're going to be taking on the outside of the building while I was taking care of the inside. During the search two Madison schools went into precautionary lockdown. Police guarded the doors of Chavez and Leopold elementaries. Both schools released on time but in Verona about 200 parents waited in line at Badger Ridge Middle School to show ID and pick up their kids. Well, it's scary, you know, you're, you wonder what's going on and what they're doing in there and um, we live really close by so even, you know, where they were searching was close so, um, you know, just keeping my eye out the window and looking around to see what was going on. After about three hours, the lockdown lifted late this afternoon. Relieved parents ran to their kids waiting in the school's gym. Happy to have them home. And when they showed up today, some parents said that they hadn't even heard about the lockdown. They were upset at what they called a lack of communication with the district as this whole thing unfolded. For their part, Verona administrators say the lockdown went well. Eric. All right, Theo Keith in Fitchburg at Nesbitt, Fitchrona. Theo, thank you.